All right then, testing one, two, three. Just briefly going over some areas you may want to look at in L4 M1. Constructive response type uh, questions. All right, so I'm looking at within outcome one, understand or understanding on analyzing the, oh, sorry, understand and add, understand and analyze the added value that can be achieved through procurement and supply chain management, all right? So I'm just gonna give you a quick summary. One, the different categories of spend, all right? Have a look at that, direct and indirect. Two, the different types of cost and procurement, fixed, variable, direct, indirect. Check that out. It's in your study guide. Three, different types of procurement, stock, non-stock, right? Something you ought to have a look at as well. Knowing the classic matrix, right? What is it about? Right, one of our favorite tools. Features of capex and operations expenditure. Point number five. Point number six, knowing the five rights of procurement. Yes, you can be tested on that. Point number seven, understanding total cost of acquisition, total cost of ownership, whole life costing, right? Appears to be similar, total cost of ownership and whole life costing, but there are some differences, right? In terms of where they they are used. TCO used more in uh, the acquisition of, fix of, of uh, assets and whole life costing more in construction. Check it out. It's in your study guide. Eight, supply chain management versus networks or versus supply chain networks. Something you may want to look at, right? Supply chain network is an extension of a supply chain or as I always say, it's like a supply chain on steroids. It's a very complex supply chain. Have a look at it, right? You might be asked to compare them. Nine, the aims or the, or the objectives of supply chain management. What are they? All right, something to revisit. Ten, understanding uh, the Mendelo's matrix. Yes, know all about it. The Mendelo's matrix, aka stakeholder management matrix, if you want to call it that. And while you're doing that, remember connected, st connected stakeholders, all right? You have internal, external, and connected stakeholders. See, so I have the diagram right there for you. Um, 11, the purpose of KPIs in supply chain management and procurement. 12, waste management, yes. All right, so waste management in procurement and closed loop supply chain. Uh, while you're looking at waste management, I want you to look at the EU waste management directives. All right, let me bring this up for you. Something you need to learn. Most of us aren't from that, that part of the globe, so you would not be familiar with it. Battery directive, landfill directive, right? Know what they are about, and also um, the we objective. Have a look. It's in your study guide. Recycling, reuse, repurposing, right? You want to revisit those um, areas as well. 13, defining value in supply chains. Well, it's not in order, but point number 13 will be a very early conversation in your study guide. All right, where um, you SIPs will take you through all the different areas of value. And these are them here. All right, they are right here. Price, delivery. Let me make it a bit bigger. These are the areas you may want to look at. Make it a bit bigger. Price, delivery, storage, ethics, environment, sustainability, communication, quality. Yes. All right. 15, introduction. Yeah, yes, it's an introduction. Introduction to negotiation. 16, an introduction to input terms. That's in your guide as well. 17, supply chain tiers, supply chain levels, right? First tier, second tier, what are their features? Something you need to look at. And 18, final area, final, um, area I have identified. Elements of strategic procurement. This is, this is also in your study guide where you, and it's in your tutor notes as well, where you are introduced to the following. Added value, cost, inventory, logistics. Purchasing quality supply and waste management. Have a look. All right, so those are the areas in learning outcome one of L4 M1. All right, some of the areas I think you should have a look at, right? Please review those areas. Testing one to three.